Hi, my name is Jada Davis with the Tandabaho Parish Library, and this week we are reading Poet X by Elizabeth Azevedo. This book is written in verse in the words of Zamora Batista, age 15, daughter of Dominican immigrants. The main characters are Zamora Batista, 15-year-old twin of Xavier, also known as X. Xavier Batista, Zamora's male twin, quiet, reserved, and smart. Mammy, mother of Xavier and Zamora's very religious, wanted to be a nun and hard worker. Pappy married to Mammy, father of the twins. He was, was a womanizer and drinker until they had Zamara and Xavier. Caridad is Zamara's best friend and hangout childhood friend of both Zamara and Xavier. Aman, Zamara's secret guy friend. X is at the age where she is starting to have a lot of curves and receives unwanted attention from boys. She feels like she has a lot to say, but no one cares to listen. Her brother, whom she calls Twin, gives her a journal so that she can write everything she thinks and feels down on paper. She starts to like a boy named Aman, and they start meeting secretly after school because if her parents knew, she would be in trouble. Her parents want her to concentrate on her schooling and God and not be hanging around with boys. Throughout the book, she starts to come to terms with having a voice and sharing that voice through poetry. In this book, everyone has a story or secret and with the proper support and outlet, happiness is at hand. I really like this book because it was an easy read. There is some abuse and found language. I think teens will like it because they can probably relate to some of the feelings and situations Zamara and Xavier are going through. Some of the topics are, number one, sexuality and shame. Number two, religion and coming of age. Three, the power of language. If you would like to read this book, please pick up a copy at the Tangibaho Parish Library. We hope to see you soon. Thank you. And keeping with the theme of the Poet X, today we are going to learn how to write a bio poem. Now, a bio poem is a short biographical poem. It's about a per uh, and that describes a person. The point. This is a poem template written in the present tense or it can be used to uh, write a poem of someone who's passed. I have put, included this template in your teen pack at every Teen to Beho Parish Library to get you started. Now, first on this template, it has a short bio poem of, of the famous jazz musician Thelonious Monk. Now, it, it will show you uh, a poem here that you can then sort of copy for yourself. So the template starts you off. First, you write the person's first name. It could be yourself. Then you write the person's birthplace. Then you write the adjectives describing the person. Then you write what this person loves. Then you write what this person fears. That's a big one. Then you put uh, what this person feels. And second to last, you write what this person would like to see 
in his or her life. And lastly, you write the person's last name. Now, I have done one myself. So, first, I, it says write the first name. My name is Jada. So, I wrote that. And my birthplace, born in Louisiana. Write three adjectives describing the person. Now, Phonologist, I don't think that's a real word, but I like to describe myself as a phonologist because that's what I do for the teens at the library is try to make sure everybody's having fun. Second, I have foodie. I love food. I watch videos and that kind of thing I want to see food from around the world. I want to know what's going on. And lastly, I'm a homebody. I never like to go anywhere except on a cruise once a year. Uh, and it asked me, what do I love? I love dogs. I have two at home, and um, I don't know. I feel like a dog is a man's best friend. What I fear, crime. Ooh, I can't stand crime. I'm getting old and, you know, can't fight like I used to. Who feel, I feel importance of finding happiness. Isn't that what the world's about? Finding happiness and doing for others? And what would I like to see? Probably humans be uh, more to mind their own business and stop worrying about other people to uh, criticize, you know. And lastly, it asks for my last name, which is Davis. So if you would like to write your own poem, pick up this team pack. It has mazes and everything. And of course your template of course, uh, it's His uh, Hispanic Heritage Month and also Voter Registration Month. You can pick it up at any Tangipahoe Parish Library. And remember, just have fun. Bye!